gonna show you how to make a really simple memory game. So allowing kids to match up pictures of items. So this would be something we might create for a younger audience and it's kind of fun. All right, so I'm gonna start. Um, you can create a title slide and stuff if you want. With this one, I'm gonna go ahead and just do a really basic uh, title only layout. And then I can go in, if you so choose, and put in a design to go with this. So I've got a cute little pegboard design. And I might just type, you know, something like aquatic animals memory game or something like that. All right, now I go about actually creating the game board. That's my first step. So I'm going to start by putting in some pictures for the kids to match up. And I'm just going to use clip art to demonstrate how to do this. So I'm going to start with a turtle graphic. And grab this little dude. Maybe make him just a touch smaller there. And then I'll make a copy of that so he has a match. And I'm going to place them on my game board like that. All right, now I'll do the same with a couple more graphics. And scroll down to find one that I like. We'll grab her. And again, we make a copy. Oops. Yep. Making mistakes. There we go. Copy her. Paste her. And we can use these little guidelines to line them up here. More or less. Might shrink her down just a touch. There we go. And we'll get one more. Copy him, paste him, and put him into the grid. All right, so I've got my game board. I've got these somewhat randomly placed around the board. Now I've got to create the uh, backs of the cards, so to speak. And we're gonna just use some rectangles to do that. So we're gonna go to Insert, Shapes, and choose a rectangle. And I want to draw that rectangle so that it can be the same size on each of the shapes. I unfortunately lost mine for a second there, so. There we go. Now I copy that rectangle and paste it and move it over to the next picture. Try to line them up. Do the same, paste it again line it up. And I'm just going to go all over the board like that. Paste another one. Drag it down. Paste another one. Drag it down. And last one. And it looks like I need to move this turtle over just a touch to hide him. Okay, so that's the basics. We create our page, insert our pictures, copying and pasting one of each so that we have about, I've got six on this board, I'm keeping it really simple, and then cover them each up with rectangles. When we come back, I'll show you how to make it into a game.